everybody welcome back on my channel this is Buji from JK with another video about voice cams I have made a couple of videos about the voice cams already but this video is requested how to factory default those cameras how to factory reset voice cams and this video we will learn step by step how you can factory default those cameras hey friends if you haven't subscribed my channel please click on subscribe button then click on ring bell button so you can get the latest video notification from my channel so now let's talk about a factory reset why do you need to factory reset if you have some kind of issue with those cameras they are not working with your app they are not communicating they shows offline or some kind of issue like that you don't need to be factory reset you just simply disconnect your power cable from backside for like 30 seconds plug back in and your issue will be fixed just only cycling power I will recommend do not factory reset unless it's necessary. Like say if you want to sell this voice cam or you want to give away somehow, then yes, you need a factory reset because these cameras have a small electronics inside. When you have a set up your camera first time, they create some kind of set of file inside. If you try to factory reset too many times, my you can run uh, in some kind of issue like same we do factory reset our cell phone that's the same process we are going to do with that one but before you factory reset just understand once we start process when we start factory reset process do not unplug this camera do not turn power off until you have finished your process just in case if you are trying to do factory reset and your power cable got disconnected or something my you will be run out some kind of issue this camera not gonna work anymore it can happen so now let's start how to factory reset so we will talk about the two models over here we have a both are wise cam v2 models there's also wise cam v1 model so these specific models they have a setup button on the bottom they also perform as a factory reset button this camera you have to press and hold this button for four to five seconds and this camera will speak ready for setup or your camera is already factory default but if you have a model v1 then you have to keep hold this reset button for 15 to 20 seconds so now we are going to start factory reset i have a here in my app there's a three cameras so i have a first one it's my this camera let me bring that yeah it's the first one this camera second one this one probably yes i'm not going to upgrade anymore okay now i'm going to record my screen and my camera shows online you can also see whatever on my cell phone over here so you know you don't worry about to be uh, getting on my phone from here and we will factory reset over here now let's start i'm going to do the, this camera for factory reset for this one as we talk about we are going to press this reset button for four to five seconds okay that's it it takes about like four seconds probably less than four seconds to be factory reset and my phone this camera shows offline right now and i heard sound it says ready to connect that means your wise cam is already factory default now what you have to do you have to go to your uh, device over here you can go to setting and and the setting at the bottom it says delete the device you can delete permanently from your list and this camera will be gone like say you click delete yes so now i have only two cameras we can do factory research same way this one 
So now I brought my camera more closer to see clearly which button I'm pressing and how we factor reset. So I'm going to repeat same process we have done already. So simply, that's the camera, that's the front. If you flip it down at the bottom, you will see here is the, the tiny, tiny have a push tab. We simply gonna press it and hold it. Once your camera, once you press and hold this button for four or five seconds, and you will hear from the camera ready to connect. That's mean your YZ cam model V2 is already factory reset. But if you have a model V1, then you have to hold this button for 10 to 15 seconds or 15 to 20 seconds, and your camera will speak out your YZ cam is already factory reset. Ready to connect. Now our YZ cam is already factory reset. So now same way you can factory reset this one. Any camera, any wise cam, you can just factory reset by pressing the button at the bottom. You can uh, use same button to be set up. Now if you have to set up again, then you have to press that button again and your camera will be in setup mode and you're good to go. That's the way you can factory reset your wise cam. That's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you like my video, please like, share, comment and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you for watching.